Hello traders, welcome to Harris Blue. This is Steven Gove, and in this video, I'll discuss about Jing. So, I think you remember last uh, few days I'm uh, creating this Jing and given some support and resistance. So, previously, you can see that Jing they are forming in a daily chart, uh, daily time frame, they're forming uh, hammer pattern, right? So, you can see this is the hammer pattern they are continuously forming, and after that, given a retracement, here was a resistance line and price again create a new low. That means uh, Jing is creating lower low and the lower uh, lower high for, uh, from past a few days, right? Lower low, lower high. So here they have uh, they are forming some candlestick pattern. You can uh, say like a hammer pattern. So when they are forming a hammer pattern, the price just pull up a little more and up to near uh, sorry near to resistance line. So after reaching that resistance line, price again fell, right? next you can see here all right so again they are forming a hammer pattern have you seen this is the hammer pattern above this uh, resistance line and the price just given a correction near here you can see previous uh, supporting uh, previous uh, this was resistance or supporting line now here they become a resistance line so from this area we are expecting price again uh, it will fail near 183 the p near to previous lower point right uh, this is our expectation because they are creating a lower low right so we can see this is a hidden uh, hammer pattern so if you want to know more about that uh, candlestick pattern like hammer whatever you just digit to our allies blue website and just see here and iq pays are there can just uh, visit whatever you want trading strategy so you will find every trading strategy so I'm posting here and indicator trending indicator momentum what type of indicator you want to know and how to use and how to trade so everything uh, explaining here so again and uh, I'm posting here continuously and pattern you can go to chart pattern uh, candlestick pattern so you just see uh, if you want to see the candlestick pattern you just visit there so all candlestick pattern i'm uh, posting here like uh, everything uh, dozy pattern engulfing pattern whatever pattern you can see here so right so now you can see here they form here hammer pattern right daily price just given a correction from this area near to resistance line so next we are expecting the price will fall near uh, this area right around 183 because they are creating lower low right and then now you can see in a small time frame let me check it because in a daily time frame we have seen the price is just uh, running in a downtrend now for in four hour charts uh, i think two to three days uh, they just price was bullish right so now you can see this is a supporting line have you seen this is a resistance just price comes near this supporting line and start filing from this area so next target are here you can see this is the first target here uh, uh, last target around 183 but before we uh, uh, go to this area so we have to find out another supporting line so I want to connect here you can see they're tested many times so that is uh, that is why I just uh, trying to uh, place a supporting line here right you can see they are tested many times so in previous market so we have seen this is another zone right this is the zone this is zone so after breaking this area right so price comes uh, went to this area so again like that another zone again entered after breaking this area they are forming so you can see so now you can see similarly here is another supporting level we have seen here around 187.3 so remember this is another supporting line right so now what what happened people are thinking this is a downtrend is a time to sell but problem is what you can see market just open in a gap down right so what basically happened when market uh, just trying to uh, when market open a gap uh, down or up uh, they're trying to fill up this one similarly you can see this was a closing right this is a open right so this uh, this portion is a gap right it is called gap down 
the shop window gap down so after few hours they try to fill up this gap have you seen this one so similarly price we know that market will come down but if you enter here for the sell here uh, if you are for the sell uh, if you want to take a sell position so what happened similarly here uh, you can see that try to fill up this uh, gap so there might be they will try to fill up this gap right so if you want to enter here so automatically it will hit your sl right after reading this sl again price will so now we have to find out the where our entry point right uh, this was a four hour chart so let me show you in a 15 minute time frame right now you can see this is a 15 minute chart have you seen this one so the price is creating lower low and lower high right lower low lower high lower low lower high right continuous there forming a lower low right you can see now you can see here price just open a gap down right in 15 minutes you can see they just price just open uh, below this uh, moving average 200 this black one all are moving average uh, exponential and all moving average like a 5 uh, 20 50 100 150 and 200 moving average continuously right so according to ascending order right so just uh, they broke this area we you can see so let me a little more zoom so it will comes uh, like a little more uh, market will be uh, like uh, clear visualize you can see here so now we can see here so uh, 15 minutes you can see let me so it will be clear right there so now you can see the price was running like that uh, so first uh, let me show you uh, like that right like that so if you want to connect here uh, at trend line by connecting this swing point have you seen uh, this is a swing point like that uh, swing point here higher low swing point swing point so in that area they broke this trend downtrend and was placing a uptrend right so similarly here you can see if you want to connect here lower point let me show you this is the lower point right this is the lower point uh, lower point lower point lower point like that right so let me i'm trying to connect this lower point so have you seen this i just connected the lower point right have you seen this is the lower point connected this is the lower point this was after breaking this line uh trend line so price was just placing uptrend right creating higher high higher low like that like that so after that they broke this uh trend line which was uptrend now they're running in a downtrend have you seen right so that is why if you want to enter here for for buy and sell so you just wait to break this 187 level right if they break 187 like uh, below 50 point uh, and so even start selling from this area or if price comes near 200 moving average have you seen if the price give the retracement from this area so like that here comes below and they retrace the market this is a cell and uh, this is the anti point like that so you can see similarly here you can see this is a uh, create new low and it price comes near 200 uh, it is a sell position and close your position around 187 right to 187 at 30 and keep your asset just above this uh, 200 moving average right so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe thanks for watching